Hello everyone, Dan here from the Next Issue Podcast. On today's video, I'm going to be doing a review for Nightwing 119. This is the latest, newest issue of Nightwing. We have an all new, different, brand new team, right? Uh, Tom Taylor and Bruno Redondo recently completed their run uh, in the Nightwing book. And now we have a whole new thing. Uh, let me talk about the creative team. We have writer Dan Waters with art by Dexter Soy. Uh, Veronica Candini and Colors, Letters by Wes Abbott. Uh, I am a big fan of Dexter Soy. He has a very stylized uh, art style. And Dan Waters uh, is a fantastic writer. So I wanted to check out this new title uh, just to see what can you do with Nightwing, right? Uh, sometimes after, after one of your favorite runs ends, uh, you have a little bit of trepidation going into the next one right can they really go for it like just as an example after uh the venom run that kate and stegman had i'm still struggling to get back into a venom book just because that stuff was so good and i can't help but to compare it but uh on on you know that being said uh this new art is great it starts off with a really really great premise uh you know there's a lot of uh there's, there's a lot of things happening in Blue Haven, including uh, because a lot of the big bosses were taken down during the events of the previous run. Uh, the crime in Blue Haven, uh, it's very unorganized. So we have this new entity coming in. Uh, there's a lot of circus uh, imagery in here because obviously it's Nightwing, right? It, that's his origins. Uh, and it's really good. I really, really enjoyed it. Uh, it's pretty dark and grim when it comes to the tone very different from the previous run which i think that's a good thing you want to separate it and kind of build a thing for yourself um also uh dexter soy's art really works especially when it comes to the action and the designs of some of these characters we're going for some really really goofy designs right we have uh we have the mama bear gang and buzz bludgeon and dr proboses and of course the blockbuster gang so like you have all these kind of like really goofy goofy uh villains and gangs uh from blue haven that have very unique distinct designs so uh yeah i really think that dexter soy really works for the art um because i'm doing these reviews a little bit different you will probably see some art throughout the video but i'm trying to change up the way we do some of the videos here just to see like uh if people are enjoying this but yeah i love the way dexter soy uh draws nightwing uh, when he poses him like hanging from a roof or whatever the case may be, uh, you know, throwing a kick uh, while he's hitting somebody with his scrimmage sticks. Like, yeah, it all really works for me very well. Uh, I'm very excited. Uh, I'll do a separate video on all the new all in titles as to which ones I'm reading, which ones I'm waiting on and which ones I'm just skipping uh, of the main series in DC. So, uh, yeah, very exciting stuff. Uh, if you have read this book, though, let me know what you thought about it down in the comments, as always. Thank you for watching, everyone. Remember to share, like, subscribe. If you're enjoying this new format of me just kind of hanging out outdoors, uh, let me know. I'll try to make more videos like this. I think this works. I got a nice setup, and I like being outside, especially now that it's not super hot in the summer, or maybe find some different locations to shoot. Uh, but, yeah, uh, thanks for watching, and stay tuned. We have more comic reviews, trailer reactions, TV recaps, all that fun stuff in the channel. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye-bye.